All right, now Samsung Notes is one of the most powerful note-taking application available in the market today. And this application is getting some exciting new features on the Samsung Galaxy phones. Thanks to Theodism on X for sharing the latest APK of Samsung Notes application on which we are going to take a look at all the new features. Of course, this has not yet been rolled out officially, but here is the first look of all the new exciting features that you need to know. On the left hand side, I've got the brand new version of the Notes application and on the right hand side, I've got the older version of the Notes application. Let's take a look at the first feature. For that, let's open the Notes application. The first new exciting and useful feature is Math Solver. Yes, now we can solve maths on the Samsung Note itself. Let me show you that. Let's go to the uh, new note here. Let me tap on the three dot button. Now right here you can see turn on math solver option is here, which is not available in the previous version. All you need to do is just tap on turn on math solver. Now the math solver it's turned on. Let's quickly check this out. Let's say 25 multiplied by 25. I just select equals here. You can see the answer is already displayed. Now let's do another one, 25 divided by five equals five, as simple as that. So now we have got match solver feature right there on the notes. If you wanna turn it off again, go back there, you can just tap on turn off match solver. So that is the first feature we have. Now let's take a look at the second new feature that is customizing the toolbar. Let me swipe all the way towards the right here. You can see there is nothing here. When I swipe towards the right here on the newer version, you can see this all new icon sitting here. When I tap on that, it's gonna take me to customize toolbar option. And here we get to customize only few options, not all the options. You can see we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And here we have got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14. So we've got 14 options here as tools under preview section, whereas the available tools to drag and reorder them are just about 10. So it starts from undo button here. You can see this is the undo button. Now what I'll do is I'll bring this undo button all the way maybe towards the third position or fourth position. I'll reorder this. You can see that has gone here. Now let me bring it back there. That's how we can reorder this. Let's say S pen, I'll bring it back to the top here. You can see this pen is right here. So likewise, you'll be able to reorder these tools on the uh, toolbar as per your requirement, as per your convenience. So that's a pretty cool new feature Now we have. Now let's move to the next cool, exciting new feature. That is editing cover for the notes. Let me tap on three dot button here. Here we've got this option, edit cover. Let me tap on edit cover here. Now you can see we have got a brand new section here on the newer version. Let me just enable this. And here we don't have enable toggle. That's because none is already selected. So uh, then we'll have to swipe towards the right to get to the patterns here. We've got various different pattern options here. And then we have got illustration, various different options. Then we have text, which is already there on the previous version. So on the older version, you can see we've got a different version here. We've got cover styles here. You can select the color that you want and you'll be able to select the cover style here. You can also see under text, we have got a different tray for the stickers here and we have got cover option here, whereas cover and style options are right here and we have got stickers here. It expands like this on the previous version and on the newer version, we've got a separate tray here. So we have got variety of options now, illustrations, patterns, etc. for the uh, on the newer version, whereas on the older version, it is limited to title, with some color options and some preset style options with some stickers. Now moving on, let's check out another new feature here, another new change. Let me tap on three dot button here. Now here we've got share notes, which has got an arrow here. Whereas on the previous version, we have got invite collaborators and add to shared notebook, two different options. And here we've got shared notes. I don't see invite collaborators option here, but it will anyways bring up the same menu. As you can see, when I tap on shared notes, we get two options, share a single note and add to shared notebook. If I'm not wrong, add to shared notebook itself is uh, something similar to invite collaborators because it brings up the same uh, menu options here. Let me 
tap on invite collaborators, you can see invite people to share notes. And here when I tap on share as a single note, you get the similar options here. So that is a minor change which has happened on the latest version of the Samsung Notes. Now moving on to the next interesting and useful feature. Now we can add sticky note on a specific note. Let me show you that. Let me tap on plus button here. As you can see on the newer version, we have got sticky note option and we don't have it here on the uh, current version or the older version. When I tap on sticky note, it opens up a sticky note here. I can uh, write anything that I want here and I can shrink it. You can see this icon is available here. I can press and hold on it and uh, move it around wherever I want. I can place it in the corner here. And when I tap on that, it expands. I'll be able to type or add more data here. And I can also change the styles. Let me tap on this three dot button. You can see we have got different background style options here and I can delete this sticky note as well. So that's a pretty cool option. I can also yeah resize this, which is very nice. So we do have sticky note features. You can see I can drag it around as well. This is a brand new feature, which is now available on the latest Samsung notes, which will come in the upcoming update. Currently, I'm able to see these new features on the latest version. If I find anything more, I will uh, post it on X. My X profile link is in the description. Go ahead, uh, follow me on X. Uh, I will be sharing some very important information, which I may or may not share on the channel. So do follow me on X. Uh, and yeah, of course, we have got our own wallpaper application, which I more or less mention in every video. We've got some brilliant wallpaper getting added every day. I think you guys should go ahead and check it out. We've got both free and premium versions. The link for the application is in the description. Go ahead and download it. You're going to get to enjoy loads of amazing wallpapers on the application. Thanks for watching. That's all I want to share with you guys. Hope you have already subscribed to the channel. If you haven't done it already, go ahead, subscribe and give this video a like if you find this video informative. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.